गुड मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट इन दिस वीडियो सेशन टूडे वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट डिजेबिलिटी टेस्ट बिकॉज दिस डिजेबिलिटी टेस्ट इज वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट फॉर रेड्यूसिंग एनी नंबर सिंपली वेन वी डिवाइड विदाउट डिविजन हाउ कैन इजली वी फाइंड बाय द गिवेन नंबर नंबर इज एक्जैक्टली डिजिजुल और नॉट देयर आर सम रूल्स नॉर्मली वन टू अलेवन वी हैव टू नो अबाउट द डिजेबिलिटी टेस्ट हाउ टू वी हैव टू फाइंड द डिजेबिलिटी टेस्ट इजली एंड फॉर दैट देयर इज सम रूल्स फॉर डिजेबिलिटी टेस्ट वी नो वेरी वेल दैट Any number is divisible by one itself. So we have to know, discuss about divisibility test for one, because every number divisible by one. So now we let first divisibility test for two, five, and ten. First of all, I am talking about two, five, and ten because these all numbers we have to check its one place digit. If one place digit is divisible, there are some rules. Just I am talking about that. So for two, for five, and for ten, we have to check at one place digit or we can say last digit if divisible by the number so for two this all we have to check at one place digit for two for five and for 10 we have to check only one place digit what should be there just we have to identify ki what digit comes digit i am talking digit that is 0 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 and 9 This is called our digit. So which digit comes on the place once, and when we say that this number is divisible by two, this number is divisible by five, or this number is divisible by ten, or not? So for two, five digit out of ten we have to say. For two, if at one place there is zero, two, four, six, and eight, out of these zero, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine, if one place. This is you have to give in, ending with zero, two, four, six, or eight. Only that number is divisible by two, except this any number turns just like one, three, five, seven, or nine. Ending that number is not divisible by two. Just like. One, two, three, four, five, eight. Anyone? We have to ask. This given number is divisible by two or not? So not we have to see what this number we are given. We have simply check at one place or ending digit. So ending digit is eight. And we know very well that if a number 
is divisible by uh, if the number end with 0, 2, 4, 6 or 8, that number is divisible by 2. So, in this number, we have seen at one place there is 8. So, we can say that this number is divisible by 8. Uh, so, 2. So, then how can not we have to written direct answer? In this number, we have to just given the answer. In this number, add one place, then it is eight. So one, two. 3, 5, 3, 4, 5, 8 is divisible by 2. So when we have to give in the answer, not directly say, just we have to write that statement, whatever number you have to give in. So in this number, at one place there is 8, so this number is exactly divisible by 2. Let's another number, 2, 2, 2, 2, 2, and here you have to give in 7. Now this number is divisible by 2 or not. So in this number, what we have seen here, so just we have to check one place digit and one place digit there is seven so this number is not divisible by two because for divisibility two what number should be there there is only zero two four six or eight only that number is divisible by two so how can we given the answer in 2, 2, 2, 2, 7 at one place there is 7 so 2, 2, 2, 7 is not divisible by 2. So, when we given the answer in notebook, just we have to write proper statement, not given directly a statement yes or no. So, by for 2, we can say that how we can say easily the given number is divisible by 2 or not. So, for that, out of 10 digits, we have seen 5 digits is there or not. That is 0, 2, 4, 6 and 8. If ending number or one place digit end with 0, 2, 4, 6 or 8, that number is divisible by 2. Rest number comes at one place 1, 3, 5, 7, 9. So that number is not divisible by 2. Now, just I am saying 5. So for 5, only one for 5, we have to see out of this thing only two numbers. What for 5 we have to check same place at one place but two digit or not 0 and 5. At one place if there 0 or 5 only that number is divisible by 5 and the rest one is not.
So just like we have taken in another example, here we have mentioned 5 and here we have mentioned just then 7, 3. So now answer is remains same. In this given number, at one place digit A, now what is? Just we have to change the statement here in which 5 show this number is divisible by here we have to mention 5. In next number, what we have seen here? So in this number we have to change at one place there is 3 at one place there is 3 and for 5 we know very well that what two digit comes in that is only 0 and 5 show this number is not divisible by 5 simply we can give in the For 5, I think understood. For 2, we have checked 5, number, 5 digits that is 0, 2, 4, 6, or 8. If any number in which this digit, that number is divisible by 2, for 5 out of 10, we have to check only 0 or 5 end with or not. It means at one place there is 0 or 5 we can say that that number is divisible by 5. If not rest any other terms 1, 2, 3, 4, 6, 7, 8, 9 end with this number that number never be divisible by 5. And last one that is 10. So for 10, only one digit if end with 0, any number end with 0, only that number is divisible by 10, rest other not. The statement remains same, only we have replaced the digit. Suppose here you have seen 5, 0. So in this number, 1 plus digit is 0. So this number is divisible by 10. We can say that otherwise not divisible by 10. A statement same. Only we have to change the digit by which number we have to give in the divider. For 10, we have to ask, so in this number at one place digit, there is 0. So, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 0 is divisible by 10. Same. Then in this number, at one place, there is 3. So, this number is not divisible by 10. We can easily give in the answer. For 2, for 5, for 10, only we have to check 1's place digit, 1's place digit divisible by the when for 2 comes, again recall for 2 what only 0, 2, 4, 6 and 8 comes at 1's place digit that number is divisible by 2 for 5 2 days delay that is 0 or 5 or for 10 only we have to check that one place digit is 0 or not if 0 is at one place that number is divisible by 10 for 5 0 all 5 should be there at one place and for 2, 0, 2, 4, 6 and 8, any 1 out of this comes at one place, that's number A divisible by 2. 
now for 3 and 9 So for three and nine again, just like two, five, and ten, we have to check one place digit. Same rules for three and nine. Any numbers divisible by three or nine, if the numbers sum is multiple or divisible by three or nine. That number is exactly divisible by three or nine. So for that, just we have to take in some numbers. Right? Six, four, six, four, two, seven, five, zero. And question we have to ask: If this number is first, we have to check three. So in this number, we have seen what digit? Six, four, two, seven, five, or zero. So for checking divisibility three, we have to first find the sum of digit. Sum of Digits. So it is six plus four plus two plus seven plus five and plus zero. When we finding its sum, what comes? Six plus four, ten, twelve, nineteen, twenty-four plus zero, twenty-four, twenty. Four and we know very well that twenty-four is divisible by three. So easily we can say that this number is divisible by three. So sum of digits we have find out twenty-four and we know very well that twenty-four is exactly divisible by three. So we can say that this number is divisible by three. But again, what we have to write down? Just we have to find the sum of digits twenty-four. Now written in a statement, twenty-four is divisible by three. So six four two seven five zero. Is also divisible by divisible by three. Suppose if x sum comes another, let one example. Just we have to change here. Six four two seven. Four. Now we have to find again the sum of four six four two seven four. The sum of digit what digit? That is six plus four plus two plus seven plus four, and its sum is ten, twelve, nineteen plus four, twenty-three. Now we know very well that in table of three never comes twenty-three. So just simply we have to give in twenty-three is. Not divisible by three. So six plus four plus two plus 
सिक्स फोर टू सेवन फोर इज नॉट डिविजिबल बाई थ्री यू हैव टू गिवेन द लाइक दिस आंसर सिंपली वॉट फॉर थ्री और नाइन वी हैव टू चेक सम ऑफ डिजिट सेम क्वेश्चन इफ यू हैव टू आस्क नाउ दिस नंबर इज डिविजुल बाई थ्री बट वेन यू आस्क दिस नंबर इज डिविजुल बाई नाइन और नॉट तो सेम ट्वेंटी फोर वी नो वेरी वेल दैट इन टेबल ऑफ नाइन नेवर कम्स ट्वेंटी फोर बिकॉज ट्वेंटी वन नाइन वन जो नाइन नाइन टू जो एटीन नाइन थ्री जो ट्वेंटी सेवन ट्वेंटी फोर नेवर कम्स शो इज For नाइन we have to ask this number is divisible by नाइन or not. So simply ट्वेंटी फोर इज नॉट डिविजल बाय नाइन सो दिस नंबर इज नॉट डिविजल बाय नाइन जस्ट वी हैव टू चेंज द नंबर फाइव विच वी हैव टू आस्क For थ्री it is divisible, but for नाइन it is not divisible. Simply we have to change. What did it we have to add here? Against फोर we have to check the plus फोर when we add it. Now what is ट्वेंटी थ्री प्लस फोर सेवन ट्वेंटी सेवन नाउ फॉर नाइन इफ वी हैव टू आस्क Now this number. So this number, what sum comes? Twenty-seven. So twenty-seven is. Now we have to change the statement. Twenty-seven is divisible by nine. So this number is divisible by nine. Simply. Nothing should be changed. The statement is even same. Just we have to change the digit. What we have to say? So just we are saying for nine. Yes, yeah, sum of comes here digit twenty-seven and twenty-seven comes in table of nine. So twenty-seven is divisible by nine. So what number there comes? That is also divisible by nine. So it's correct. i hope you understood very well for divisibility 2 5 10 10 3 3 3 to related this divisibility i given you some questions that you have to show for divisibility test you have to check for whatever numbers you have to given for all you have to check the divisibility that number is divisible by 2 3 5 9 or 10 yes or not for each you have to retain with proper statement not given direct answer as per given statement you have to use and given the proper answer so okay students for in this video in next video we have discussed the rest divisibility for 6 for 4 for 8 for 11 whatever left we will discuss on next video for today bye everyone have a good day